Good morning. I'm at the reserve here and as you can see there is a plethora of hummingbirds. What I'm trying to do is to, uh, get some of the shots while they're feeding on these colorful tobacco plants I think is what they're called. And uh, the weather is pretty overcast so uh, I was just taking a few test shots here and it seems um gonna have to have the ISO pretty high uh, to get like a shutter speed that I was looking for about 2500th of a second uh, the ISO is gonna be at least 2000 so I'm shooting full manual and uh, let's see what we come up with I'm trying not to shoot into the sky like that because it's super bright. So um, I'm basically trying to get the shots that are right down into the flowers. Today I'm shooting the Nikon D500 with the Tamron 150 to 600 G2. And unfortunately for this lens, its uh, max aperture is 6.3. So. A nice prime f4 lens would have been amazing today yeah it looks like two thousandth of a second with a two thousand iso is as much as i can get right now now the reason i have my camera on a tripod is i like to flip from stills to video and stills to video so otherwise it would have been much easier to just handhold. But I gotta have something to share with you. Ooh, the sun's coming out, so we're getting a little bit of some better light coming up here. I think I'll take up my shutter speed. Actually take my ISO down to 1600. Hopefully the light stays this way. The mammalian flycatcher. So I'm kind of pre-focused here. I'm in full manual at this point. And uh, since the sky is so bright, I'm really having to pick the background properly so I can get some nice uh, bokeh and not have the background blown out. I am pre-focused on this perch, which seems to be its favorite. And uh, my f-stop's at 7.1, just to give me a little extra depth of field. And so now it's just a matter of waiting. And when it comes in, I can just take a burst and hopefully get it in focus. I got one sequence, but it was slightly out of focus because of the depth of field was just not deep enough. Hopefully that doesn't happen again.
Okay, so my patience paid off. That vermilion flycatcher right there. It really liked that patch of ground down here. So I just set the GoPro and I think I got the shot I was looking for. But I'm gonna end the video here. It was supposed to be about hummingbirds, but this young vermilion flycatcher here just stole the show. So I'm gonna say thank you very much for watching. If you haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so. Hit a like button, share it, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.